guests all coming from the Philippines. So say hi guys! Hello. The lovebirds are once again here and we're going to be going around Hong Kong. So I'll bring you guys with me. Let's go. What's your name English? Human. Hey guys, we are here once again and we are touring Hong Kong. We are going to be going around Central Area and we're just here. These are the people I'm with. Hi! Hello! Walking around the rain. I'm sweet. Now it's our turn to be sweet. Di na naghiwala itong dalawang ko. <laughs> hey guys, so we are here at Dr. Jin's parlor. And lately we've been trying different types of gin here. So Jeron is trying the Brockman's Premium Gin, Raspberry Gin. So the first step is to look at the gin, see what color it is. <laughs> <laughs> then you have to put in your nose and smell it. <laughs> mm. How is it? Mm. This is not bad. Okay, so first gin test. Next, we're up to the second one. <laughs> Quite spicy. I think this is from the smell. It's very spicy. Are you one mom? We can order one can of this. One? I have it. Shot. No twenty. On the rocks. On the rocks. Side. Twenty on the side. Oh yeah, ma. Maybe when we need, we we'll just order this. So my mom is currently trying the off year gin. So now we are trying the off year gin. Off year gin is made here at Dr. Fern's Gin Parlor and it is one of the gin that won an award. So we're trying So the notes are citrus, parang may orange peel, and there's a little bitterness and smokiness. I love it, I Sana all guys, sana all. Thank you. You're always right, Mom. No, I'm not always right. <laughs> I am just always right. Or can we go to lobster ngayon. Mamaya, lobster na siya. <laughs> Shelter. We are waiting for our speedboat to arrive because we're going to be having dinner once again here at Hong Kong Day Royal. So we're just waiting, guys. We're here. Hi! I'll see you guys again in a bit. Like and subscribe. Wala ko pala sa karaoke. Bakit puro Chinese to? Hindi, daw anong song na alam mo. Sige, kita ka. Oh, okay, Mike. Kita mo anong song na alam mo, love? Ano, Pongyo, Pongyo. Oh! Oh!
back here and we're having our preparations for her Tingun tomorrow. So, so far we're having the flowers ready. We have our cater tariff tea jewel. As well, sitting up outside, we're gonna be having a buffet. We're gonna be putting flowers on our staircase as well because she's gonna be having her official. I think tomorrow you're gonna be official on Jerry. And we also have our musician ready. He's yeah, actually shooting in the, piano. in the piano at the moment. And my sister will be leaving me because she's gonna be doing last minute errands while I'm leaving you I'll be right here with mom while we fix up. I just fit my outfit. Pero super stitches in the leaf is that you cannot fit or stand at the same time. Malang po at the time. My photo time for reference. Ding! Where's the photo? We're super excited to show you guys. Make sure the game of Janela is not an ami for the Tomorrow you will see. It's something unusual that you see here in the And I think it's something that makes us more proud to be shiny. Yeah, because we were really carrying the tradition. <laughs> One K map per dozen, two dozen. We get you from one eight. Fresh puto galing bagyo map. Oi ho yan do yan.
Hey guys, so I'm now back in Hong Kong after my sister's engagement. When I came back, our helper tested positive for COVID and she roamed around her house. So now, it was a COVID positive part two. My symptoms are a lot milder versus the first time I had COVID. Um, I have cough, phlegm, body ache. Thank you, Lord. I didn't have any fever. It's just that I'm positive. So anyway, guys, I'm okay overall. Thank you, God. More on drinking a lot of my vitamin C. I'm taking a lot of Barocca. Conzies. And this one, the Flam Raspberry. My sister asked my dad to bring this for me. It helped me a lot for my bad sore throat. Parang I'm still in house arrest after I landed Hong Kong. I wish I just didn't left because this is so much to do as well for the wedding of my sister. And yeah guys, so road to recovery. I've been eating a lot of fruits as well. Yesterday I had kiwi. So, so far I'm feeling okay. Hopefully in a couple of days my COVID will be completely gone. Hope and pray and then by next week I'm gonna be flying back to Manila again. So most of my friends told me as well it's just gonna be two to three days. COVID now it's just maximum of three days so yeah guys but oh my gosh i didn't know it, it could spread up this fast because her helper also didn't inform me ahead of time and she helped me unpack my things and that's when i realized hold on why are you wearing a mask and why is your voice like that and then i told her like are you positive and then she said yeah and i said oh my god my sister's getting married get away from me but too late it was very fast guys so yeah we're going to recover in lang tayo everybody so my voice is still um, recovering but thankfully I'm finally negative I took the test and I'm finally negative today we're still here at the 8 in Hong Kong it's still not lowered down so it's a good time for me to rest another day it's been raining non-stop actually since last night we also got the storm got raised up to T9 actually sometime I think early in the morning earlier today and now it's still on T8 and we're still on the black rainstorm everything is totally closed as well I could barely see any cars it's still really really draining. I can barely you can see it from behind. So yeah guys, that's just a quick update. Good morning guys. Today is my flight back to Manila. I just alarm. It's currently 6 in the morning. Our flight's at 9. I have to get ready now and get ready to head back for my sister's wedding. So yeah guys, grab it on top Anyway, let's go get ready. to have our fitting. I haven't finalized my gown yet so I have my final fitting first because last time they had to adjust my waist area as well. So anyway guys, um, that's my plan for today. The and then later on this afternoon, I'm going to be having my hair treatment done. The hairstylist will be Jenny. She's from Korea and is going to be in Makati near Glorieta. <laughs> <laughs> Final 
fitting and now I'm final messaging our SVPs. This is my gown. Yes. My sister's wedding gown. There we go. This is her um, palette after party dress. It's a mermaid dress. And then this one is for her to speed the dress there tomorrow. Happening tomorrow. And I am here. <laughs> Sorting my scalp treatment. Currently, I have oily scalp and I have very, very small dandruff. So, this one needs to be addressed to that, so that whenever I do my hair color, it wouldn't be ugly. So, because the scalp condition of my hair also affects a lot whenever I do my hair coloring. So, we're starting my scalp treatment now. There you go. We're going to be treating my oily scalp in an additional of a little bit of my dandruff issue. Finally back home. I was the latest one to arrive in our family dinner. Today we have my father's side here, all the way from Hong Kong. They came here, my brothers and sisters, and we're just having an intimate dinner here at home, sponsored by Chicho Catering and the yeah, guys. Dapper! 
Tantan mo ko. Pakitanong si outfit mo. Hey guys! So today we're gonna be sharing with you the welcome kit for our foreign guests, for their foreign guests. Which we prepared especially one by one. It comes in this bayong bag. Bayong. And let's open it. Oh. A little backstory. Why a bayong bag? Because most of our guests, it's actually their first time to come to the Philippines. So what better way to uh, express the Filipino culture with a bayong? The bayong. And it's whatever it is that is inside as well. To make, them, to make them feel welcome to the yeah. Philippines, basically. So we were actually thinking which bag to put this in. So we thought about plastic bag, paper bag, but this was what won. Essentials. Bottled water. Mm -hmm. Actually, because they, they were hydrate. supposed to have these ones engraved with their wedding initials. But parang sayang sa bayong bags. Kasi itatapon lang rin nila. Yeah, that's true. Next stop that we have is sopropyl alcohol. So they can keep it with them. And syempre, gusto natin no germs. Because of course, COVID is still around the corner, so we have to be still extra safe. And then what else is inside there? We also have drip coffee personalized with our wedding monogram. Yeah, so this one actually, we individually pack them. Each bag contains one coffee drip, and then it also has the instructions. So, so what we actually used is barako. Para alam mo yun, syempre, pride natin yan kaping barako. Of course, we yeah, are going miss Sky Flakes. This is my favorite. Sabi ko sa sister ko, I want this. After the wedding, I have to eat. Dalawa. And then of course, our signature, 70 dried mangoes. Actually, favorite to ng mga foreign guests namin. They always uh, request us to bring so much of these whenever we go back to Hong Kong or in China. And of course, para paglalasing sila, meron pang absorb. Yeah, we know that medyo maraming brands, but we wanted to stay as local as possible. That's why this is what our welcome kit contains. 